big race. King Candy didn't want Vanellope to race. He said Vanellope was a video game glitch. Glitches were not allowed to race. Vanellope asked Ralph to help her build a better and faster race cart. Ralph needed Vanellope to win back his medal. At King Candy's garage, Ralph and Vanellope worked together to build Vanellope's cart. They did it. King Candy told Ralph that Vanellope didn't belong in Sugar Rush. If she raced, the video game would break. Then she would be stuck in Sugar Rush all alone. King Candy returned the medal to Ralph. Ralph wanted to save his friend Vanellope, so he did what he did best. He wrecked everything. Now Ralph had a medal, but no friend. Ralph sadly went back home. When he got there, he peered out of the video game screen and saw the Sugar Rush game in the arcade. Penelope's picture was on the game. Ralph figured out that King Candy lied. Vanellope did belong in Sugar Rush. Ralph went back to Sugar Rush. He discovered that Vanellope needed to cross the finish line to become a real racer. Ralph found Fix-It Felix in King Candy's dungeon. Felix had come looking for Ralph because the Nicelanders wanted him back. Their video game didn't work without Wreck-It Ralph. Ralph asked Felix to do what he did best. Felix fixed Vanellope's cart. Ralph helped Vanellope get to the race. He realized that Vanellope was much more important than a medal. Vanellope raced as fast as she could. She used her glitching powers to disappear and reappear in front of the other racers. Vanellope crossed the finish line. She was a real racer at last. Ralph went home. He saved his game. He didn't feel bad about being the bad guy anymore. And he didn't need a medal because now he had friends. That was all Ralph needed to prove he was really a good guy. <laughs> <laughs>